Hillary Clinton leading in all five states in primaries tomorrow. But Bernie Sanders still drawing big crowds. NBC's Andrea Mitchell following that race for us. Andrea, good morning. Good morning, Willie. Hillary Clinton is so far ahead in tomorrow's voting. According to the polls, she could all but eliminate Bernie Sanders in virtu virtually, at least, in pledged delegates tomorrow. That said, he is still drawing those huge crowds and big money and making new demands over the future of the Democratic Party. At Yale, Hillary and Bill Clinton's law school alma mater, Bernie Sanders was mobbed, a huge crowd Sunday night. Holy moly! This is a lot of people. And during a campus walk, Sanders has the young people. But to stop Clinton, he would need to win every remaining primary by big margins. And our latest poll has him down by 15 points in Pennsylvania, the biggest state voting tomorrow. Clinton is moving on from Sanders, focusing on Donald Trump. Those insults, the kind of demagoguery that we are seeing from him, you have to ask yourself, what really is at stake in this election? And in a new ad out today. Walk it out together now. Clinton advisors are already talking about possible running mates, including Ohio Senator Sherrod Brown, Virginia Senators Tim Kaine or Mark Warner, or Massachusetts Senator Elizabeth Warren, although Warren and Clinton are famously not close. Labor Secretary Tom Perez, HUD Secretary Julianne Castro also on the list, and New Jersey Senator Cory Booker and former Massachusetts Governor Deval Patrick. Sanders is now demanding that Clinton pay a very big price for his full support, his enthusiastic support after the primaries are over, that she adopt his positions on critical issues that have divided them, like Wall Street, at the convention. Willie, Savannah. All right, Andrea Mitchell in Pennsylvania this morning where there's a big prize tomorrow. Thanks, Andrea. As promised, we turn back to Mark and Nicole. Mark, what does Bernie Sanders want and what is he likely to get? He wants to have a big voice at the convention. He wants to change the Democratic Party, move it more to the left. I think the Clintons, both Bill and Hillary Clinton, are masters at this through the selection of a running mate, the slot Sanders gets to speak at the convention, through what goes into the party platform. I think they'll find a way to unite the party and make Bernie Sanders a lot happier than he and his supporters are right now. Nicole, you know the Clinton campaign has really turned the corner of the general election when the VP talk begins. Who, what kind of person should she be looking for? We've heard Elizabeth Warren's well, name. We've heard several yeah. different names. What I mean, do you she think? wants to do that, but yesterday I Meet the Press, Bernie Sanders talked about all the things that divide them. I actually think this Sanders thing is inexplicably prolonged. I understand that he's still raising money and he's still winning states, but to no end. And so I, I admire them for sort of plowing forward, but I think that until they sort of settle the Sanders portfolio, it's difficult to focus on a running man because it's all going to be viewed in terms of Sanders' influence. All right, guys, thank you very much. Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.